Hey everyone, this is Sanjay here. This is a quick video about using the YI 4K plus action camera for recording or for streaming. I am not able to use this camera as a webcam for video chat due to inability to sync the audio with the video. Let me know if any of you have figured some solution to resolve this problem in the comment section below. I have tried to do that but I can't succeed in that. This is a follow up for the video which I made earlier using windows. If you haven't watched that hit the i button above or I will also provide the link in the video description. First of all we need a Mac and we need to just download the app called local RTMP server from Salas repository. This is his repository. This is an open source software. I have provided the link for this page in the description below. Once you are here click on the releases link and grab the latest version which is available and download the local RTMP server DMG file. Go ahead and install it onto your Mac. Once you have installed the application go to the launch pad and just launch the application. Once you have launched the application an icon will show up in the menu bar like a camera click on it to reveal the IP address this is your IP address of the local host uh, which is not uh, necessary or useful so we can find the IP address of this machine by heading over to the system preferences on your system preferences click on the network and it will uh, take you to this page here you can see your IP address of the machine in my case that is 192.168.1.6 just copy it then go to your preferred browser and head over to my QR code generator for which I have given the link in the video description. This is my QR code generator. Now just enter your Wi-Fi name, password and the resolution of the stream and the bitrate for your stream. For the network URL you need to enter the following rtmps colon double slash as you can see here uh, I have already done this one once following the rtmp colon double slash we need to enter our IP I will just uh, paste it this is my IP slash live and hit generate it will automatically generate the QR code then you can grab the camera and uh, scan it in the live mode and you can connect to the computer as you can see here I have my YI 4K plus action camera now I am heading over to the mode selector I am scrolling all the way down and here I can see the live mode I am going to hit it and I am going to scan the QR code once that is done it will automatically connect to the Wi-Fi network and RTMP server that is the app which we installed please note that the Mac and the camera should be in the same network as you can see here once it is connected the icon becomes red when we click on that we can see everything about the stream. We can head over to the OBS studio or your preferred streaming app. In my case I am using OBS. If you haven't installed OBS I will share the link in the description below. You can download it and install onto your Mac. Let's open the OBS studio. On your OBS in the source tab. This is the source tab. Uh, click on the plus button and add a VLC video source because we are streaming right so we need to add this give whatever name you like and I am naming it as VLC video source 2 in here select whatever visibility behavior you need and down here you can see a option called playlist in that we can see a plus button over here click on that and click on add path slash URL in here we need to give the URL which we entered earlier for generating the QR code. In my case that is RTMP colon double slash 192.168.1.6 slash live. Then hit OK and hit OK. Now you can see the stream from your camera on your OBS. As you can see here this is my monitor. As of now it is uh, taking some buffer. There is a delay in uh, capturing and streaming. And that is usual in streaming section so you can hit start streaming for uh, restreaming the same video stream and you can uh, hit start recording for recording purpose and uh, you can try whatever you need but I could not be able to fix uh, this one for video chatting if you have found any solution please let me know in the comment section below 
and a huge thanks for seller for his awesome project check his page out in github he has also provided something about his app go check it out and he has also a video in which he uses this application for his uh, elgato capture card so hope you guys enjoyed this video if so hit the like button or the other button is also okay drop a comment so that i can improve myself if you want to see more video like this subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching